You've heard of Dragon Claws and you've heard of Rune Claws. Maybe even you've done a quest and you've heard of Steel Claws. But have you ever heard of Bone Claws? Well, today you have. With the release of the new Grandmaster quest while Gothic sleeps, came these new Bone Claws. Originally pitched as Burning Claws, they're meant to be a spec weapon that fits in between the 20k Dragon Dagger and the 100 mil Dragon Claws. Their strength bonus is very low, coming in at plus 32 versus the Dragon Claws' plus 56, or the Dragon Dagger's plus 40. But its special attack only costs 30% spec, meaning I can do it three times in a row over the Dragon Claws' two in a row. The spec also has a chance to inflict the burning effect, which is why I'm going to be using the Eclipse set today to test these claws out. You can stack the burn from both the claws and the full Eclipse set up to five times, so if I get it fully stacked, my opponent's going to be getting a hit five damage every four ticks, which in theory, sounds pretty strong. However, theory doesn't always work out when it comes to RuneScape PvP, so let's go see what it's all about. Alright, how much are we buying these claws for? Bone claws. 50 mil, maybe? How much should they buy for? 48 mil. Okay, let's get full Eclipse. Alright, I'm just gonna attack this guy. He's he's one of those guys who's literally on Skull PKing in the big 24-7. The 24-7 the big 20-24 will literally... He's got- he's dead already! Come on, claws? Okay, never mind, they hit zeros. I'm a liar. I'm a liar. Damn, I should be fighting this guy. I just wasted my spec for no reason. Oh well. I, I'll kill this guy and then I'll kill that guy, fuck it. Or maybe I won't kill anyone, this guy might just kill me. He's got a smite on. Who is it? Eli, yup. How do people like see the same name over and over and just assume Emblem Area is Iliot 14? Like, where has his mind gone there? Just give me one hit and this guy's dead, by the way. Come on. With the claws. Oh my god, bro. I've never met a worse spec weapon in my life. I've actually never met a worse spec weapon in my life. Come on. Is he even burning? No, I didn't hit anything with it, so he's burning ones. If I had hit more, he'd be burning more, but yeah, it is what it is. Jesus Christ. Come on. Come on, finish him. Finish him. Oh, dude, I'd legit be stacking fives with the burn right now if it hit anything. Thanks, Beckham, fuck it. Oh, I don't know why I fangs, but I don't want to have the claw spec. I can literally use that, but yeah. Come on. Okay, I think I got another burn effect on him now. Yeah, now it's hitting twos. Ooh, that's nice. Refreeze him. That's not too nice. Okay, that is. Come on. 44 for the KO. Good fight. Don't know why he's on Skull PK. Dude, those claw specs could have absolutely murked him, but it is what it is. They just didn't hit. It just did not hit. 757k loot though, we'll absolutely take it. First kill on a PK air with all this stuff. Oh shit, okay, we gotta fight with this guy, good luck. He saw us kill the last guy. He thought I was Eli, so we're gonna have to kill him for that one. Don't know about calling me Eli, okay. Okay, does he have gear? So I see why he's doing the whole noob thing. He's actually good. I've seen that quite quickly, fighting him. Prey mage. Go for a freeze. This guy's definitely very, very good. Might have to get him with a Void Awaker. We'll see, though. Bro, I wish I actually got a freeze and he couldn't just run around like a crazy man. Chancing me. Come on. Come on, Claws. And I hit a zero. Typical. I don't think he knows I have a Void Waker, though, to be fair. So this could be big for us. This could be very big for us. Depending. Oh, if I hit a 40 there, it would have been bigger for us. Okay, if- Well, if he doesn't know I have one, he hasn't- he knows one now. But yeah. That wasn't too sneaky, was it? Come on, I need some big hits here. Void Waker? Dead! Oh, claw him, claw him, dead, come on, oh my god, that was perfect, we actually got him, we actually got him, oh my god, we seem to uh, have been starting a little party here now too, this maxer really wants me, but I don't know about that one, buddy, but that was so nice, we actually got him with the void waker to the claw spec, oh my god, I'm gassed, 
So that combo has literally never been done before. Because the Bone Claws only cost 30% spec instead of 50, I was able to Karasi into Claw spec him there for the KO, which was insanely cool. 7.5 mil loot as well. You know how it is. He's just going to be unscald with AGS and Dragon Cross, but I'm going to just go for it, bro. I'm trying to use this new stuff. I don't have time to wait around for fights. Come on. He thinks I'm going to pray. He's ca he's kind of pray melee pretty hard right now. I might just have to Void Waker him, to be honest, if I get a nice 40. Okay, he's eating up there. Come on. Jesus, okay. Now he's hitting food, so I got to eat. And maybe get some distance between us. There's the AGS. As expected. Catch that freeze. Nice. I don't have two super combat, so I gotta go quick with this one. Let's see what he prays here in a second. He's gonna pray melee. Void Waker. Oh. I'm just gonna go for the claws. Into the fang. Into the Atlas dart for the burn. Crazy DPS right now? Not even, dude. <laughs> Not even. Super combat up. Let's see what happens here. Void Waker. Dead. Oh my. Atlas Dart. Insane hits right now. This actually makes a lot of sense. Okay, okay, okay. Come on. Freeze him. Nice. Fuck. What happened? What happened? Did I just get him frozen out of food? Oh, he's cheating. Come on, dead. <laughs> oh my god. We finally got him. I literally just Atlas darted him to death. That's so funny. The specs did not do much there, but I think he was out of food and just getting comboed a bit too hard. Only... 900k loot from an unscholar. Still better than like a Skulls PK from before, so I'll take it. Come on, Fang, I believe in you. Come on, buddy. Okay, we got the burn now. That's good at least. I just drank a super combat by mistake as well. Okay, another burn. That's good. So it stacks twos there. I just need the right hit. Claws? Oh! Come on! He's gonna pray mage! Dude, that so should have been it! Oh my god, bro! That was perfect! That was perfect! And he was praying mage because he thought I was gonna, uh, what's it called? Void Waker spec him. I just didn't get the right hits there. He was literally 1 HP. The fucking burn was hitting 4s. Oh my god, that was actually perfect. Good luck to the man. Well, good luck to me, to be honest. I don't know why people say good luck when they're the ones who want to get the kill, you know what I mean? So, bad luck to him. I think I'm maging in the wrong gear right now, so let me just figure that out. Okay. I think I've got it. And this guy is gonna run away like a crazy guy, so we gotta be careful here. One freeze would really help us. Instead, I'm staff bashing. I don't know how I've managed that one. Oh my god. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, we finally got him. That took us way longer than I'd care to admit. He is praying melee heavy, so it might be a Void Waker angle, but we'll see what happens after I start fanging him. Come on, Atlas Dart, I believe in you. Come on. Oh, okay, those are not the hits we needed. Those are not the hits we were looking for. Froze him, nice. Probably want to just stack the barrages here. I imagine he's going to camp prey range. Come on, nice. That's a big freeze. Give me another one. Oh, if I got another one, I would have gone for something. Let's see what happens here. Void Waker him on the run. He's going to pray melee. Claws. Bro. Perfect. And I hit the ones like that. That's actually just sad. That's actually just sad. Freeze him. Oh, dude, this DPS is kind of insane right now. This DPS is kind of insane right now. Go for the freeze. Claw spec. Oh my god, bro. And I hit the zero there. That's so sad. That could have gone crazy for us. That could have gone absolutely crazy. Freeze him. 
I got a primal here. I don't know what he's gonna spec me with. It was Void Waker. Good thing I ran away. Come on. Just freeze the man, bruh. How hard is it? How hard is it, bruh? 35 there. Run as far away as possible. Nice. I did the cheeky lure. Come on. Oh, I really thought he'd pray melee there, not gonna lie. Oh, that's a big hit. That's a big hit. Oh, that's a nice refreeze right there as well. He might try pray melee here. On, refreeze him? Dude, how much food does this guy have? I've done 687 damage. Like, what? How is it even possible for him to still be eating? I just want to know that. Is that too much to know? No way, I got him as well. Damn it. Come on. Oh, I got him frozen. I got him frozen. Come on. Void Waker. Oh! Trade the hit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit, dude. Holy shit, dude. What a fight. What a fight. Oh my god, that was absolutely crazy. That's what's called risking it for the biscuit. Shout out Chris Archie, dude. Oh my goodness gracious. I did like 730 damage. That guy was still eating, bro. That was terrifying. For 5 mil loot, I'm risking like 100 mil, dude. It shows I'm protecting the Void Waker. I bought these claws for 50 mil. Oh my days. If you enjoyed that risk, please consider subscribing. I'm only 2,000 subscribers away from 130,000 and I'm really trying to hit it. Come on. Claws! Void Waker! No! Right now I'm fighting this flowers guy that I would have killed earlier if my bone claws had hit absolutely anything. And I'm up 200 damage and he just starts saying off and starts running. So yeah, that just happened. I used my combo food and I was praying mage because he had a crossy spec and he got me with the Abbey Dagger. And now come to think about it, an Abbey Dagger is the spec weapon between a Dragon Dagger and the Dragon Claws. Only 25% spec and is way more accurate than my Bone Claws as you can see. 
and definitely has a my, higher max hit. I guess it is 70 attack while the bone claws are 60. So maybe I need to be using this on a lower account build or something like that. However, if this video gets 2000 likes, I'll do a max set from scratch, starting with the bone claws. I know you guys love it and I'll get it done for you guys. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss it and I'll see you then. Thank you guys so much for watching.